If you're a building material manufacturer that uses case studies to help you sell your product, you need to watch this video. The majority of manufacturer case studies and likely your case studies as you have them right now are not set up to help you close the sale. What I'm going to show you today is the exact formula we use with our clients to help them create case studies that convert potential customers to sales. As well as we're going to highlight the biggest mistake that most manufacturers are making with their case studies. Hi, I'm Zach Williams with Venvio where we help building material manufacturers outperform their competition by dominating their digital online presence. The problem that most manufacturers have is they focus on the wrong part of the case study. Most manufacturers have a page on their website where they say client success story and say how our product was used here. And that seems like a really logical way to go about structuring case studies, but it actually doesn't do very much for your audience because your audience doesn't care how your product was used. They care about their problems. They don't care about how you help Gensler for example. They care about how Gensler achieved a certain result by using your product. It's all about showing results in a way that matters to your audience. To solve this problem for our clients, we've developed what we call the case study conversion formula. There are three key parts to this formula. The first one being the benefit. What is the problem and how did your audience solve that problem? This needs to be results based. Your audience should know exactly what they're going to walk away with. Let's say you have a product that's really energy efficient and helps with acoustic sound, for example. Well, then you should say how Gensler achieved a certain sound reduction while being eco-friendly. That would be the title of your case study. It doesn't need to be more complicated. The reason why people would be more inclined to watch that or read that case study is because they want to see how Gensler achieved that certain result. That's what matters to them. So if you target contractors, make your story about how you can be more efficient and make more money. The second part is the story or the content of your case study. And this is the process and the problem that your audience went through to find the solution to their situation. You're not focusing on pushing your product here. Where your product naturally fits in, that's great. Talk about that. But don't make that the focal point of your case study. The third part of the conversion case study formula is really simple, but most manufacturers don't include it at all. It's the action point. What's the next step you want your audience to take? You've captured your audience who told them how to do something great that they want to do. Tell them what to do next help them go through the funnel further. The reason it works is because it will humanize your product and it will simplify how your product can help them with a the problem that they deal with on a daily basis. Remember, people don't want products, they don't want benefits, they want solutions. They want answers to the questions that they deal with on a daily basis. Let me give you one final example. Let's say you sell a roofing product. Instead of making the case study how our product was used on a large subdivision, let's focus on your audience the contractor or the builder. So structure the case study around how one contractor or builder was able to save time and money on a large subdivision and then find ways to weave in your product when necessary. This is going to capture your audience and get them to watch or read your case study unlike anything else you've ever produced. So there's actually a link below this video that you can download a template that we put together for this case study conversion formula. So go download that case study conversion formula template right now Get started on improving your case study, convert more leads to sales, and make more money. Until next time, I'm Zach Williams at Venvio. Go create those case studies. Thanks.